I'm not squeezing into these and for all the naysayers, why don't you tell people your real set? Why would I lie? Why would I lie? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Common Tea. Hi guys. Today we're gonna do something a little different. You guys seem to love our comparison videos, so we wanted to do a comparison video between Sarah Ray Vargas and Alexander Rodriguez. So we're gonna watch a little bit of Sarah Ray Vargas's haul from Express, and then do a little bit of Alexandra's Boohoo haul. Ray Vargas SRV, that's me, and how cute are we? Today I'm presenting to you another video featuring Super my dogs, cooler. Express. You guys know I love Express. They are not a traditional like plus size retailer. They're not a plus size retailer at all actually they go up to a size 18 and an extra large however it's a very generous 18 and extra large considering they are a straight size retailer so if you are anywhere on the cusp if you are mid-size if you are anywhere in that region and you haven't checked out express let this video just be the be the reason you take a couple clicks i will have the links for absolutely everything down below this video is sponsored by express and they are probably one of the only companies that regularly sponsor me and i still constantly shop them in between videos because i love their stuff especially their spring and summer stuff that is when in my opinion they absolutely shine they have great workwear they have great denim they have great coats if i can get into them i can't always get into them but spring and summer the little dresses the shorts hi let's start with this dress already i just love her energy i love her introduction she actually does shop for them regularly she's actually using the things that she's sponsored for in an excel all i have underneath is um a shaper panty this is a really <laughs> basic shaper panty it's going to here i, I like love that she tells us she's dresses. wearing shapers this one is an excel it does still have room okay Okay, I'm not like at the brink here, um, and I am traditionally a size 18 in straight sizes, and I'm a 16 in plus sizes, <laughs> and typically in plus size, I wear 1X. So, like I said, honest with their sizes, sizes. something is, Alex like, would never say. So it doesn't even, yeah, no. it doesn't even stretch, and it still fits like this. <laughs> back when people had summer functions, aren't they cute? I'll show them to you up close. Uh, but back when people had summer functions, <laughs> the better days <laughs> back then. We used to like go out and be cute in the summertime in the heat, and this is always what I was wearing. Always, okay? And these are things that I do not get rid of. Express dress. Here we go. Express dress. Express dress. I can't get it up. Express dress. Like, when I tell you, they are the spot. They are the spot for the summer dress. Could have kept going with those, but um, let's, get, let's continue. Look at how cute these freaking sandals are. Well, they're, you know, heels or whatever, but they are, like, braided across the front. And I am typically kind of on the cusp. I don't normally need a wide width, but with a lot of certain retailers let's say i really do need a wide width because i find that their shoes run super narrow express i'm like a perfect fit so i don't need a wide width or anything and they do have really pretty um oh, accessories i didn't buy any really oh i bought some masks i'm gonna show you that but um they have really 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 great accessories i feel like they look super high class like high end they always have sales going on so you can get things very affordably if you're shopping at you know the right time i really appreciate how she talks about sizing and how she's yeah. so honest about it it just feels like She's really trying to help you. Like, she's really like, if you're going to order this, like, if you are bigger than me, it's not going to fit. Or if you're a little bigger than me, you'll have room. Like, I have room here. She's very honest in that sense, yeah. where she's not <laughs> giving us false hope, like, just buy my stuff. Like, yeah, she has no reason to lie about her her weight or like her size. Top is in a size mm -hmm. XL. It is a true, like, wrap top. You do actually have to bring it around and wrap it. I don't know that it's, like, really doing me any favors. I think it's, like, cute in theory, but... I think my torso is not long enough to really give this what it needs. Is that it? I think that might be it. You know what? It might just be the shorts I'm playing with. So these are a midi length. I folded them up just because I have my preference. I like how descriptive she is. Yeah. Length, you see. A high rise. And she short. doesn't always love these everything when she teams. says it. I know a lot of you guys have seen that trend going around uh, on TikTok about getting like the extra button to eliminate this, which is what's happening behind me right now. Um, that doesn't work. A lot of people suggested it to me. That doesn't work for me because I don't need the front to be any tighter. I need the back to be tighter. And when you pull on the front, it doesn't, oh, I can show you. So it many women's problem, honestly. eliminate the gap. Mm -hmm. Like I would have to pull the crap out of these shorts and it's still not gonna eliminate it. I can still feel the <laughs> So uh, it doesn't work for what my, you know, little issue is, but I understand it works for other people. These shorts are obviously then just a little loose. They're obviously too big on the waist. Um, they're a little bit loose, like under the butt and stuff. They definitely have space in the thigh. I'm not squeezing into these and for all the naysayers, why don't you tell people your real set? Why would I lie? Why would I lie? <laughs> <laughs> Don't sing ever. These are an 18 regular and they're a little big. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna make it work. Hi. 
would Alex show us her tag? Tag? No. no, never. She'll just say it's an 18 and it's a little too big. So let's take a look at Alex and see how she compares. Hello and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today we are doing a plus size try on haul. Now that we are moving into spring and then summer, the warm weather, I've never been more excited. I just feel like winter needs to go. So a lot of these pieces are geared towards the warmer weather ahead and then an optimistic headspace about warmer weather coming. I bought a decent amount of stuff. Of course, I will link everything below. Let's get into it. So in the warmer months, I feel like you just can't go wrong with having a bunch of nice tank tops. I love wearing these on. They go with so much. Dress them up with like a sheet pair of jeans and some cute wedges and a nice belt. And they're just staples. And this one is perfect. It's so like actually comfortable. I was expecting it to be more uh, like cheap. Oh my goodness. What is happening? <laughs> anyway, this tank top is like really nice quality. It's actually very stretchy and comfortable. Am I not doing this right? I thought I was. I can't, I'm gonna have to do more research on this later. Uh, I just went ahead and Right off the bat, I noticed that she doesn't do a full body shot. No. You're only seeing like maybe at most that. Her thighs. Right, her thighs. I don't know if it's because her room is so small or, I mean, she can't be. She has a huge house. She should be able to pull back the camera. Mm -hmm. She also didn't mention the size at all. No, she just went right in. Yeah, like she does not saying like if it runs small, if it runs big. Paired it with these really cute. And those look baggy. Bag. I wasted shorts. I yeah, love pieces like this. Good. Uh, yeah. I just always think they're so flattering. They can also be dressed up or dressed down. I'm very confused about this. I'll go back up the camera a little bit. I just feel like high waisted mm. shorts mm. always look so cute. And like I say, every time I feel like they can dress up or down. Uh, so cute little shorts, nice fit, they feel comfortable. Okay, so I was just so drawn to this dress on the website when I was shopping. It's so beautiful. It's just so springy and airy and gauzy. Like, oh, it just gives me all the springs in my lives. Like, if you have, <laughs> uh, you know, any sort of wedding or baby shower, anything to go to, hopefully by the summer, maybe we'll be able to do that. I don't know. I just think this is so beautiful. Like, I don't know. So I will obviously talk about this. So there's a few options we can do here. Uh, I'm not like throwing out this dress because of it. So my bra, this is a Tory bra. I like to wear this when I do try on holes because like, it's nude, it gives me good coverage. Um, but it's one of those bras that like comes up here and a normal bra would like go like this. So if you had on a bra that had like a plunge, I think you'd be fine, um, I do. Or you could take a pin and pin it. Or you can wear a tank top under it, like a cute little, a cute little, even a lace bra like could look nice. There's options. You know, another thing that I noticed is that Sarah talks about the outfits on her body. She says, it's not working for me. And she doesn't say anything. She's literally just showing you the product. She's not telling you, for my apple body, oh, this doesn't she fit would never, right here. She would never say for my apple body. Yeah. Are you kidding? She never says that. She actually says, for my non-hourglass shaped right I never see her wear anything from her hauls really there's only a couple of times where I see her actually wearing them in her vlogs or her other videos so I'm like do you actually wear these clothes I don't know you know but that is something to note but overall I just think oh these are so pretty like I'm sorry I'm sorry it's so fun and these are my favorite kinds of dresses it's got the wrap the orange looks nice on her. unfortunately yeah. it's too tight in the boobs it's one of those fabrics it does have like a it's little bit of like yeah the boobs are just too tight but I thought this was just so cute. I just oh, Easy I love the color for spring and summer. Uh, <laughs> these ties are adjustable, but oh, you know, a little too tight in the boobs. It's just oh, so easy breezy. She's so easy breezy. <laughs> like it's a lot of work, but it might just be worth it because the stress doesn't. Okay, is that too short or just me? If she it raised her hand, short, yeah, it's not only tight, but it's too short. Yeah. Like for me, if I'm trying on the dress and I'm like, should I wear this outside? And if it's too short, I'm gonna be like, okay, guys, this runs short. You know, I always and do the bend test. If yeah. I can bend over without the dress pulling up. Yeah, no. That's something for my soul. And like I always say, if a clothing item um, or anything, really, that's appropriate, gives you like a tingle in your heart and soul, it goes She never says right, what so size that up, was. We have no. just like a classic jersey cotton knit um, maxi dress. I just feel like these are essential every year. They're just easy to throw on. They're great for throwing it on as a cover to go to the beach. Like, I feel like this looks so cute too with like uh, a denim shirt wrapped around the waist with some cute tennis shoes. You can dress it up with some wedges and cute gold jewelry. Julia necklace and these earrings and my bracelet are all from Miranda Fry. You want anything? Oh. But the discount code is fearless. So I just got this um, kind of loose fit maxi dress here. And one thing that I love Late to do, if you ever want to do this, take the side, quick little knot. No. I love the way this looks. So that always kind of adds like a chic little element to it. But these kind of dresses are just essential. I don't know. I feel right. Ooh, if you want to go batty with a moto jacket, ooh, smoke show. So if it's not clear, <laughs> I love easy breezy dresses in the warm months. <laughs> easy breezy again. It's still cold right now, but I love that time of year just because throwing on a really cute, easy, comfortable dress is like so effortless. Like you look put together, you look cute, but like you're super comfy and cool. So next we have this dress here. It's interesting because it's like flowy mm -hmm. from here out. I don't like that. Like, almost more fitted up here. Again, 
this bra would not go with it. But if you guys don't have this bra from Torrid, so what bra would you wear rolls, with that? Really nicely. Pompous, strapless. But I do like the fabric. It is like stretchy and really comfortable. Um, yeah, like it's just a cute, easy breezy dress. I like easy the breezy, I love easy the breezy. Flowy dress, cute little floral pattern. It's easy. It's an easy dress. Beautiful. After watching this in comparison to Sarah's, I think that Sarah does a better job of describing the outfit. For sure. I think what Alex does do a good job with is talking about accessorizing and how to wear it. But she doesn't describe the actual outfit enough for us to get a good idea of the sizing material, the fit, if you should size up, if you should size down. Whereas Sarah does a really good job of like, hey guys, size down or size up or this gives me a gap in the waist. Whereas Alexandra, everything fits right. perfect. Except, you know, she said that one dress was, it was obvious that it was tight, but she never like talked about the length or the fabric doesn't stretch or it's this size I could have sized up, but she didn't talk about that. See, what I like about Sarah is I can see myself going to the Express website and I'm looking at the same pair of shorts comparing myself to her body and saying, okay, well, she had a size 18 regular, so maybe I should either size up or size down. But with Alexandra, she doesn't give you that option. So you go to the website and you're kind of, you Lost. might as well just look at the sizing chart without looking at her video. If she is doing a try on haul and she wants to sell these clothes, people need to know what size to buy. So it'd be helpful if she did say, you know, I get this in a size 20 and it runs small or whatever the case is. What do you guys think down below about the comparison between Sarah and Alec between their haul styles? Do you prefer one more than the other? Is there things that either of them can do to improve? Let us know down below. Thank you for sticking around. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you soon.